Hi everyone, I'm, I'm sure you have been waiting for this moment. Now is the cooking time. I want to show you how we do the pizzas. And as you see, my dough has been raised quite nicely and it is ready to be baked. And we have got lots of different uh, toppings. The toppings we have got, as you see, the tomato sauce, cheese, pepperoni, salami, mushrooms, uh, jalapeno, red onions, Calabrian chilies, again, some fresh, uh, fresh jalapenos, some basil, garlic, and uh, some uh, green olives. We, of course, we have also some uh, fresh mozzarella and a little bit of cheddar. I usually like to put cheddar on my uh, pizza and the ratio I put is 70-30, 70% mozzarella, 30% cheddar. And that cheddar will give a nice taste to the pizza and basically the mixture of 70-30 and it is perfect. We're going to bake everything for you in our wood fired oven and uh, it has been open for past four hours oh wow it is quite nice and hot and i think the temperature should be something in the region of over 500 like 5 550 something like that i'm going to show you two different pizzas how how to make them one of them is the most famous pizza in the world and that is margarita or cheese and tomatoes. What I need is one pizza base, I'm going to spread that. You can use, you can use uh, dough roller if you want to do it and you cannot do it by hand that's my pizza peel and uh, that's around 11 inches, 10 or 11 inches. We put our uh, tomato sauce on that. Margar usually margarita doesn't have anything except cheese and some tomato sauce. And we try to put a little more sauce on that than anything else because there is, an, there is nothing and we, I try to cover the whole thing except the crust, the rim. I put very small amount of normal cheese on it. Some fresh mozzarella and that is ready to go into the oven. Okay, it should take about two minutes to be baked. So far, it has been in the oven about about one minute and I think it should be another one or two minutes more until it gets ready and uh, the base is getting cooked and the cheese has been melted just very small amount it has to be melted a lot more and uh, I hold it up in the oven so it can uh, it can bake nicer. By the way, I, I can see uh, you can see I'm doing it in a wood fired oven. Not really. You should have wood fired oven. You can do the exact same thing inside your house, inside your uh, normal uh, oven in the kitchen. 
if you have got electric oven, gas oven, any of them, as long as you can turn the temperature up to something in region of 450, 500, you're going to be safe. This is our pizza. Look good. I'm glad. I need some fresh basil. And this is the pizza. Uh, one more thing you can do is you can put a little bit of uh, olive oil. You can brush some olive oil on the on the crust around the pizza. That will that will make your pizza look a lot nicer and sexier. Bon appetit. Now we're gonna do the second pizza. My second pizza we call it Calabrian. And that has uh, tomato sauce, has got some mushrooms. Oh, I have to put some cheese. I put a little bit of cheese, I forgot. Some uh, pepperoni, some salami. I put a little bit more cheese on it. I put some uh, cheddar. Calabrian chilies. Calabrian chilies are Italian chilies from Calabria in Italy some marinated uh, garlic and the pizza is ready to go into the oven putting Toppings on the pizza is endless. You can use you can use your imagination and make millions of different pizzas. Anything you want, anything you want, you can put on the pizza, and you can have it. Whatever your preference is and whatever you like. You imagine you have chicken, you have a steak, you have tofu, you have green beans, you have. Uh, uh, chili, you have whatever, whatever you have, you can put on the pizza. You want to put some lettuce on it with mayonnaise. Yes, make your pizza, take it out, mix some lettuce with mayonnaise and put on top of that. Basically, it is endless. You can have hundreds of thousands of different pizza combination and you can make it. Right now, I just showed you two. And uh, in a couple of minutes, I'm going to have the pizza out. You're going to see it. Another one and a half to two minutes, the pizza is going to be ready. I think the base is baked quite nice. Uh, and I'm going to put another uh, piece of log in the oven. So to be able to maintain the heat and keep it nice and warm. And by the way, today I made nine breads as well earlier on and next video i'm gonna show you how to make homemade bread and then you can have you can make like a baguette or you can make flat bread any bread you want you can make and uh, the dough for the bread is well, a little different to dough for your uh, pizza base and has to be a lot more wetter and has to have a lot more water in it than your pizza all right i think the pizza is done oh yeah you can see how beautiful that is 
This one I'm going to slice it to six. Last one was eight. We brush some olive oil on the rim. So make it look aesthetically going to make it look nicer. And also if you decided to eat your crust, going to be a lot tastier. Bon appetit. Thank you very much for watching. Please do not forget to give us a thumbs up. Uh, underneath the video and also join us in our Facebook page and like us in our Facebook page and anytime we have a new video out we make sure you're gonna have it thank you very much please if you have any question do not forget to uh, ask me you can message me from my uh, Facebook page or you can uh, put the comment underneath the video we're gonna we're gonna answer you back. Thank you for being in your homes. Enjoy your pizzas.